Oh my god. I got I can't even do this right now. Oh my god. I can't talk about this right now. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. Okay. Hello, everybody. Um, welcome. I can't even talk no more. Uh, I just, I, I can't, I can't deal with this anymore. I can't. Okay, I, I, uh, what's going on, guys? Um, today... <laughs> Um, I'm gonna talk about uh, Dalton Alden Sterling and um, I don't know if I'm gonna put this commentary up because I'm a cry cried I'm still crying but um I'm sick and tired of this man I'm sick and tired of <gasps> Sick and tired of people. <laughs> I'm sick and tired of people having to die for no reason. Like, <laughs> I'm sick and tired of this. I'm sick and tired of this, dude. <laughs> and <laughs> I'm sick and tired of it, dude. I'm sick and tired of what? Like, I'm, I'm not trying to be racist, but white police officers. I'm sick and tired of this. Dude, yeah, seeing this man die on video. That's not. That's, this is the people that are trying to protect us? These are the, these are the, the heroes that we look up to? No. I'm sick and tired of this, man. I'm tired of this. I'm sick and tired of white people. I can't, or not white people, but white police officers that think they can just push everybody around. I love white people, but I, I, I'm sick and tired of this, man. I'm sick and tired of ra racial profiling. I'm sick and tired of all of this stuff. I'm sick and tired of people who, who are, are from different places and, are, you know, are different people and they just get treated bad. I'm sick and tired of it, man. It happens almost every day. To pe different people, people everywhere. Uh, people get freaking profiled every day. You know, it if, even if you're from somewhere else or if you're black, you're white, it doesn't matter. You still get profiled every day. I'm sick and tired of people having to die. It's not, it's not worth it, man. So many people have died. <sighs> 
Trayvon Martin. Oh my god, now it's Alton Sterling, 38-year-old man. Works at a store, pinned down by two white police officers, and killed. Shot and killed. I'm tired of this, man. I'm tired of, I'm tired of racism. I'm tired of all of this, man. I was going to make a video about Dwayne Wade going to the Bulls. But I saw this. And I had to make something about it. Because I can guarantee you, if I didn't, who would? Who would honestly speak out? I'm sick and tired of this, man. I don't want to see this anymore. You know, like, my family, we don't even... Well, my mom is afraid of the police. So I, I'm afraid of the police. This is why everybody, we don't mess with the police. I'm sick and tired of this. Police brutality needs to stop. And the police officers got put on administrative leave. Do you know what that is? Let me go ahead and tell you what that is. Let me read the Google definition right here. It's a temporary leave from a job assignment with pay and benefits intact. So that means they're getting paid to do nothing. They're not working for a little while, but they're still getting the benefits and the money. No. They should be locked up. They should be locked up. I'm sick and tired of it, man. I'm sick and tired of this stuff. Where They, they just don't even do anything about, oh, you know what, administratively, no! They should be locked up in prison behind bars. They are killers. They are killers. He did not kill anybody. He did not bother anybody. He just he's not shooting anybody. Then why are you why are you killing him? You were you literally have him pinned down to the ground. There is no reason why you should be killing anybody. It doesn't matter what race he is. It doesn't matter who he is. If he that should not have happened, period. Period. I'm sick and tired of police brutality, man. I'm done with it. I'm honestly fed up. I'm done. I can't handle it anymore. I can't stand it anymore. I don't want to see it anymore. Because I guarantee you, I hate it. I don't like it at all. I don't like any sort of violence. I don't mess with that stuff, dude. Honestly, I can't deal with this. These dudes should be in jail behind bars. And I can guarantee you, their lives are ruined now. Wait till people see them on the street. I know their names are out there. Their names are out there, man. And people are going to be looking for them. People are going to be looking for them. And guess what? It's not going to be pretty. You can get stares everywhere. You can get looked at everywhere. You know what I'm saying? They might not be hurting you physically, right? But mentally, they're, everyone's going to be in your head. You're not going to be able to go out in public feeling the same ever again. You're going to wish you're behind bars. You're going to wish you're behind bars. I can guarantee you that. I'm sick and tired of this stuff, man. I'm sick and tired of being profiled. I'm sick and tired of other people being profiled. I'm sick and tired of it, dude. I'm done. I'm fed up. I just can't handle it anymore. I don't want to see it. I am done. Dude, I'm so sick and tired of this. This stuff really gets to my heart. Because I can feel for these people. Because I've been in this position. I've grown up in this position. Because I can understand how it feels. To be pushed around by people and the police. I can understand how that is. For being different. For, you know? <sighs> I'm sick and tired of it, man. I literally have no idea. I feel for people, man. I feel for people. Because it's just it's just not it's not good, man. And it's just... I feel for these people. And it's like... They just keep getting the same... The same things keep happening. But there's no repercussions for it. Administrative leave? No. Prison time. I want to see some serious charges being put on them. I honestly want to see some serious charges. I want to see people having to be scared... A police officers have to be scared of police brutality. I don't even want them to do it. You know, that should be that should be an offense. That's murder still. You killed somebody. That's murder. Doesn't matter if you're a police officer, doesn't matter who you are. You still killed somebody. What's the difference? You killed somebody and now you can walk the streets freely and you're still getting paid to do nothing? No, and you still have benefits? You should be fired from your job, you should be put in jail, and you should honestly learn that violence and killing is never the answer. These people should be in jail. There should be a reason. Because people, you know, there's. And I'm not saying every every cop is a crooked cop. But I'm just saying for the ones that are, they know they can do whatever they want. And they can get away with it. Because the system is corrupt. And I'm sick and tired of having to deal with this man. So please, please, please just just pray for this man right here. He doesn't, he doesn't deserve to get an emotion. He didn't, he didn't deserve, he didn't, he, uh, he didn't deserve to die. 
Honestly, no one deserves to die. Imagine having to walk out. Uh, imagine having to know you're gonna die one day, and knowing that you you're gonna have to die by police brutality. He honestly looked like a good man. You know, there's nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong with him. I mean, <sighs> just please, man. It's a very emotional moment, and it's this thing has been trending worldwide. And I would really appreciate it if you could just pray for this man. Please, I, I'm pray for his family. Pray for the people around him. Pray for his community. Because things are not going to be the same for them ever again. And, um, you know what I'm saying? Please, let's just, let's hope that this can stop. Because I'm sick and tired of this stuff, dude. Um, I'll go ahead and catch you guys in the next video. Where I'm actually going to be talking about Dwayne Wade's free agency. And I'm out. Thank you. know if I'm gonna put this commentary up because I'm a cry cried I'm still crying but um I'm sick and tired of this man I'm sick and tired of <laughs> I'm sick and tired of I'm sick and tired of people having to die for no reason. Like, I'm sick and tired of this. I'm sick and tired of this, dude. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I got. I can't even do this right now. And huh, I'm sick and tired of it, dude. I'm sick and tired of what? Like, I'm I'm not trying to be racist, but white police officers. I'm sick and tired of this. Is it, God, dude, seeing this man die on video. That's not that. This is the people that are trying to protect us. These are the these are the the heroes that we look up to. No, I'm sick and tired of this, man. I'm tired of this. I'm sick and tired of white people. I can't, or I'm not white people, but white police officers that think they can just push everybody around. I love white people, but I, I, I'm sick and tired of this, man. I'm sick and tired of ra racial profiling. I'm sick and tired of all of this stuff. I'm sick and tired of people who, who are, are. I can't talk about this right now. <sighs> okay, okay, it's okay. Okay. Hello, everybody. Um, welcome. I can't even talk no more. Uh, I just, I, I can't, I can't deal with this anymore. I can't. Okay. I, I, uh, what's going on, guys? Um, today. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna talk about uh, Alton Alton Sterling and um, 